for those who don't know, who didn't watch the build. Got a little bottle over there, right there. Got a little bottle right there. That one actually right there is a spare. It's always full. That one's the one that actually functions. Didn't want to be lopsided. It only have one on one side. And as you can see, it was a major pain in the ass to pull that apart and open up the bottle every time by hand. So I got a bottle opener. But even with the bottle opener, I couldn't really tell if there was air in the lines, if it was actually engaging, if it was working. If I haven't used the bottle in like a week or so, I'd have to crack the line. And um, it's just kind of like a real pain in the ass. So I'm gonna go ahead and hook up this little purge kit and hit the little button from inside. Make sure I got gas coming out and I'll be able to tell from the cabin it's all working good. So I finally got this purge kit and uh, it's not necessarily to have fire breathing dragon flames coming out of the roof or anything spectacular like that. It's mainly to clear the lines out because I don't use the bottle all the time. But when I do go to use it, I don't want to have to pop the hood and crack the line by hand every single time. This will come in handy, be able to hit the little button, clear out the line and be good to go when in need. So let's go ahead and install this thing. Shouldn't take too long. If you follow the car audio install, you can see that everything's still here. I barely ever lift this hood for any reason. Got the Takeda intake. With my little nozzle right there. I'm gonna have to pop this cover off to get to the valves though. All right, so as you can see, got my valves, actually my solenoids right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and stick this thing right in front of that solenoid, so. Got to add that, add this, put the little tube on, hook up the wire. It should work pretty good. Doesn't look very complicated. like a good fit but you know nothing ever pops right in without a battle so I'm gonna have to carve some of that out but I'll retain the outside clips should still hold very well all right so I had to carve almost all the guts out of that but as you can see Fits right up in there. <laughs> yeah, let's pop it in. All right, it's all done. It's all wired up. Time to put the cover on. Let's go see if it works first. Yeah, works good. All right, that's all done. Here's the basic rundown how it works. I use this remote control button to turn on the bottle, actually to open the bottle. It's open. Got 
this little button right here turns it on as you can see right there and we go ahead and purge the line out ready to go